Arika Misha and today we are making some Lipton Ice Herbal Tea. Guess what flavor y'all? It's my new addiction. Well one of them. Iced Herbal Tea. Strawberry and watermelon. I'm showing y'all because sometimes y'all be thinking I be making stuff up. Herbal Ice Herbal Tea. Strawberry watermelon flavor. Lipton y'all don't show that. When I saw it in the store I said I don't know about that. Strawberry and watermelon, now that do sound good, y'all. That do sound good. I said, but I don't know about it in the tea flavor. Look how they got the little watermelons over there, y'all, in the tea. Ooh, with the lemons. I said, I got to try it out. I tried it out, and it's good. All right, so as y'all see, caffeine-free. Hey, that's another good thing, caffeine-free. But anyway, it still tastes good. All right, it's got 16 uh, pouches in here. I have made this tea numerous of times, and I said, I got to share it with the people. I got to share it. I got to share it with y'all. And it's quick and easy. You know however you make your tea. Quick and easy. I've got my five cups of water over here. in my pot getting ready to boil. But I don't really boil, you know. I like for my water to come to a nice little, you know, nice little soft boil. Not too much. Y'all know tea bags. We done bust your tea bags. And I'm putting all 16 bags of these in here. I'm putting all of them in here. Just dropping my bags in there. Just throw it in the bag. I'm just dropping all my bags in here. All 16 bags gonna go in here. Get my bags all in there. And I usually let my, like I said, I put it on a low heat. And I usually let it sit for about 10 minutes. About 10 minutes. Let me get my fork over here. I just kind of like push my tea bags down in the water. Making sure the water soaking up all them. Watermelon, lemonade flavor. I'm telling y'all, this is some really, really good tea. It is so good. Think about it. Strawberry and watermelon. Hello. Come on now. In a tea? Mm, 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 mm. Lipton, I appreciate y'all. Word of the day. Appreciate people. Word of the day. There it is. Appreciate people. Appreciate what people do for you. Stop thinking people just supposed to just do stuff for you. Who are you? Appreciate when somebody do something for you. Say thank you. I really appreciate that. And y'all already know when I get y'all water today, I be talking to myself too. Appreciate people. Thank you. I really appreciate you doing that for me. I appreciate that. Whatever it is they doing for you. Appreciate people. Y'all better start appreciating people. Around here thinking people supposed to just do stuff for you. Better appreciate people. Shucks. Anyway. Uh, so let me get back to this tea. But... All right, y'all. So I'm gonna sit, let my tea sit for about ten minutes. It's gonna be a quick little video. I just want to come and show y'all. Let me show y'all that once again. That is the Lipton Ice Herbal Tea Strawberry Watermelon Flavor. Yes, it's so good, y'all. I had to come share it with y'all. This gonna, like I said, it's gonna be a little quick little video. Oh, look at that picture, y'all. Oh, y'all can't tell me that watermelon. I ain't got no watermelon and strawberries to put in my tea, y'all. So I'm gonna be looking for that. I ain't got that. So I just got the tea. But some little watermelon slices. That sound cute, y'all. That sound real cute. But, okay. All right. Okay. Anyway, so let's go ahead. I'm going to let this sit for about 10 minutes. Let me take y'all in a little bit so y'all can see how the water's already turning pink from the strawberry watermelon flavor. <clears throat> I'm going to let it sit for about 10 minutes. And then I'll come back and show y'all how I make my little quick tea. I also made on my channel before how I make my Kool-Aid. I already, if I can remember, I will link that video below so y'all can see how I make my Kool-Aid. Because I'm making Kool-Aid today, too. So, I already did a video on that. But like I said, I'm going to try to remember to link it below so y'all can see how I make my Kool-Aid too. Because y'all know Kool-Aid, tea, we love all that good stuff. So, alright, I'll be back. And I'll be, like I said, I'm just going to let this sit for 10 minutes. And then uh, next thing y'all see is I'm showing y'all how I make the tea. Quick and easy, y'all. I just wanted to share it. In case you know y'all like tea. Y'all know I love sharing. Sharing is caring. Like my children say. Alright, we'll be back. Okay, guys, let's get our tea together. Quick and easy, guys. Quick and easy. I, all, I always use three cups of sugar. That's just how much sugar I use. Say what you want. That's how much sugar I use. Three cups of sugar. I like it sweet. We like it sweet. Don't act like y'all don't know. Anyway, so I always use leftover containers around the house. You know, you got a tea container. That's cute. I got a tea container too, but whatever. I like using leftover containers like this Walter's Juice container. 
So anyway, all right, I like using the little funnel. Makes it real easy for me. Let me show y'all. The funnel makes it quick and easy for me. And I've already drained my tea bags out of my tea. I'm gonna go ahead and pour this in. Why it's still nice, fresh, and hot. Okay, we got that poured in. All right, and I'm gonna go ahead and put my three cups, my three cups of sugar in here. First, let me, let me dry this out. I'm gonna rinse it out. Rinse it out, where's my napkin? Okay, all right. And I'm gonna dry it out, because if I would've poured the sugar in there, while I was wet for me putting the tea in there, my sugar, y'all already know what would've happened, so. All right, so I had to dry it out. Now, I got my cup measure. I'm gonna put three cups of sugar. I always use three cups of sugar, sometimes I'll do four, <laughs> if I'm feeling crazy. <laughs> But I ain't feeling crazy today, y'all. Something like that. Put put y'all up so y'all can see. And see, the funnel just funnels everything down in there. I think I'm going to do half a cup today. I'm going to do half. Yeah, I'm going to do half. So three and a half cups today. That's what we're doing. All right. Three and a half cups. So we're going to let our sugar just funnel down. I love using the funnel. It just makes it quick and easy for me. So you got your sugar just funneling down in there. Come on sugar, we ain't got all day. I love making tea. Quick and easy. That with our pot. All right, so remember, I just got my tea in there, my hot tea, and I got my three and a half cups of sugar in there. That's all I got in here right now. And I like mixing those two. Let the tea and the sugar mix and get to know each other. Shake, shake, shake it up. Yes, y'all, that is my Welch's Passion Fruit Juice container. Yes. That's how I move, that's how I roll. Y'all don't get mad at me. Because I'm using my leftover container. Getting my money's worth. Y'all better say your money. Word of the day. It's too much going on out there. Y'all better stop spending y'all money foolishly. Get a budget. Stick to your budget. You know, splurge a little bit every now and then. But there's too much going on, y'all, out there. We, we, got to, we got to save our coins. Everything going up. Everything going up. I'm telling you, everything going up. We got to be careful out here. So, all right, I got that all mixed up. Now, what I'm going to do, I'm just going to go ahead and fill uh, the rest with your nice, nice cold water. I'm going to go ahead and fill my jug up the rest of the way with cold water, and I'm going to shake it up. Hold on, let me go get the water. Go ahead and fill it, the rest of my jug, with nice water. And yes, I use water at the sink, yes. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know what y'all doing, but water at the sink is good enough for me. Got my water at the sink. I'm going to shake this up, mix everybody together, and put it in the refrigerator, and give it time to marinate and everybody to join and become one. Yes. Become one. And this strawberry watermelon tea is so good. It's so good, y'all. It tastes just like what it says. Strawberries and watermelon. You get both flavors. Strawberry watermelon. Y'all know that sounds good. Come on now. That sounds so good. All right, so I got it all mixed up. I got my little glass for you all. <laughs> got my little glass. I'm gonna go ahead and put some ice in here, y'all. Hold on, I'm gonna pour a cup real quick. Y'all got to see the tea. Okay, so. All right, okay. Three pieces of ice, that's good enough. <laughs> we got our ice, y'all. This is gonna be an ASMR. ASMR. <laughs> ASMR. Aura. Go ahead and pour it. Let me do it how they be doing on them ASMR channels. I don't know if I can do it like them. Ooh. Oh shoot. I'm wasting it. Whatever. Y'all get it. Ooh, look at that strawberry watermelon. Yes. Hold up. Wait a minute. 
Don't it look good, y'all? It tastes so good. I'm gonna sip it. Oh, y'all, ASMR. Oh, y'all, taste like strawberry and watermelon. Oh, I'm gonna let y'all look down in there. ASMR. <laughs> I'm so silly. That's it, y'all. Strawberry watermelon, y'all. You get strawberry taste and you get watermelon. I'm telling y'all, this some really good tea. Y'all know I just be liking to let y'all know. That's all. The good stuff I be finding. The good stuff. So, all right. Strawberry watermelon tea. Y'all saw how I did it. You seen me do it, so you know I did it. This is Arika Misha. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on all my social media at Arika Misha. And don't forget, guys, that knowledge is power. Thanks, guys. Bye.